Hello, ladies and gentlemen, my name is... Well, it may as well be fucking stupid. You, you probably see where we are right now, and it's... It's back at the beginning. Do you want to know why? Do you want to know how much of a galactic level moron I am? So much so I deserve to be eaten by the fucking creature that's been chasing us in the previous episode. In an attempt to free up some more storage, I accidentally deleted the component footage that was necessary for reconstructing the first half of part two. But uh, I'm gonna take this as a good opportunity to try and pick up on all the things that I've missed out on. Don't worry guys, don't go clicking off this video just yet. Yeah, I'm gonna play the game up until the point where I was before, but I'm also gonna note a couple tiny details. Like, um, some things I didn't do, like this. What the fuck is this? Oh, it shuts all the pods again. Can't believe I never thought to do that the first time. I could have sworn he had a harmonica on here. Did I knock it off somehow? Wouldn't be surprised. He apparently smokes cigarettes. He's got an ashtray there. And then there's this little Game Boy console thing with a magazine with a little sumo wrestler. And this is for Taylor, apparently. Um, Valaine had a pair of shoes. But she, Valaine, is responsible for Mr. Peckles. <laughs> She also has a family, apparently. These are her and her two kids, I presume. We get nothing, because of course we're the main character, so we make up our own story. Uh, Samuels, he has a felt pen with nothing to write on. It is also worth noticing that this, this thing has enough room for an extra passenger. This uh, sixth one, which is not in use. It's also weird to see that these little panels at the bottom are popped out for some people and are stuck in for others, but uh, let's um, search this. We can search these. How did I never think to do that? Can I search the other one as well? It's glowing, so I may as well. That's bizarre. You can get crafting materials from the beginning of the game. Anything I think with a glowing light on it and it's locked indicates we can loot it. This, archive logs. This has all of the messages we have previously collected in the series so far. Um, it shows all of the things we've missed, um, including things with a potential key card number on it or something like that. Uh, things to unlock locks. So it records all the messages for us so we don't have to go back and read terminals for vital information. Uh, it also means if I ever wanted to do a breakdown video I could go through all of these. There's also Nostromo logs. Um, we have none of these yet but I presume we'll get some. And uh, all those ID cards we were finding, they correspond to missing persons in this menu here. So um, I believe this is all of the ID cards to collect. You should probably get changed before Valen calls us. <laughs> ah, you called me out. I refuse to get changed. Also, we have all of this shit. What does this do? CT scanner. That's what this is for. Can I climb in? Oh, that's what that does. I mean, I almost got swept in. Does it even go beep boop? Oh, this is Connor. I never got to speak to you before. We are aboard Sevastopol. Now, I am going to be expertly thorough in finding all of the shit that I missed along the way. Update map! Unbelievable! I didn't- I don't think I realized that was a, a feature before. I want to talk to you! Wait up. Yeah. Okay, um, this is probably actually worth noticing. So this is an entry I didn't actually read before. It says, what is Apollo? Apollo is the central AI that monitors and provides guidance for all the Sikhs and working Joes on Sevastopol. So these working Joes are synthetics created by Sikhs and company, which I would have told you guys about in part two had I not deleted all of the footage. So I never saw this on the floor. Rulo, I want to make a complaint to the, the highest authority, okay? My name oh. is Zachary Watson. That's Watson. You get that? My complaint is this. Fucking marshals. They should be protecting us. It's their job. Something's on this station with us and no one knows what it is. No one fucking knows. They put braces on the doors. Locked down. You know, oh. I like to keep something out. I'm fucking terrified, man. I'm fucking... Oh, shit. It's so cold. I don't think this fucking thing even works. Skip. Let's go, sweetheart. If I go on me. I think it's death juice. Um, my uh, evidence for this is that. Righty ho, guys. We are all caught up. We're all fully immersed in the horror situation now. 
um, everything from this point forwards. I keep moving. Some of which I have experienced because I still had about uh, 40 minutes of unused footage. Uh, there is an alien in the ceiling that is hunting us. Right. Um, we need to call the transit. I um I wasn't sure about uh this by the way. Like it, it does this music like there's something tense going on, but it it blasts this tense music in my ears and then. I couldn't tell if there was actually anything I needed to hide from or do in here. Anything I should, uh, be aware of? OH SHIT! There was something there! I didn't- I didn't know! Let's go! Ooh, damn it, there it is! Shitting shit. So once again, the objective is to get to SysTech Tower to um, find the flight recorder. Well, and also get communicate with the ship because we've got to do all of those things. You have to restore power to certain ones of these. Things are flashing and beeping and it's very annoying. Very nice. Thing is, this is another transit station though. Where does this go? That's what I want to know. Does this even work? Guessing the answer is no, considering there is nothing here. Oh, it does work. In my first attempt at playing through this section, I never got to, uh, use this, because I was so fascinated with the other areas inside this place. Um, Destination Solomon's Habitation Tower. Is that this one? No, this one is Engineering Dex. Wow! Really does just let me go where- wherever, whenever I want. Because this is officially- this is something I have not done before. He's gone to engineering. Interesting. This one just says service offline. There's nothing working there. S s Skyme to tower, is that it? If there is an imminent data danger that presents itself to me, I guess I'll find out the hard way. Then let's find out what's going on in engineering. This is reactor cooling. Oh my god, what the fuck? Is this why the place is blowing up? Is it because the, a the reactor cooling's just not working? Is that it? Everything says X. Now the whole place is useless to me right now because I don't have the right equipment. Oh shit! Since when did you get here? Hello! I am friendly. But they will. Good. Okay, this is very strange. This is too strange even for my liking. The fact that those guys were here before and now they're not. So now I'm heading to Solomon's Habitation Tower. I presume this is some kind of like, I presume this is some kind of accommodation. I don't know what habitation would mean other than that. So this is the Habitation Center. Colonial Marshals Bureau. Well, I'll tell you something, at least the service is quick. Heaven forbid I make another painstaking Great Western Railway joke. Oh shit. There's one right there. Um, is it possible to negotiate with these guys? Unless I've run it in with a wrench. That's the only feasible way I can think of passing this. Dum 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 dum. Oh dear. I think they were neutral until I hit them with a wrench. You know, that does tend to make people hostile, you know, bashing them with a wrench. Well, screw me for trying to have fun. Oh dear, that hint, I just read that hint. The sound of combat can summon the alien. So stealth really is preferred. Find an elevator to Siegson Communications. Another map update. The fact that I missed these in my first playthrough, I have no idea. Um, what's this way? Should I be aware? Oh, a civilian. Please tell me you are non-hostile. Oh dear. Shit. Boop. A survivor. Uh, who is evidently armed. Over here. Someone's here. And she's calling for help. You, f you, you, you little fucker. So seeks and security. Can we get in here? Plasma torch required. ID card on the floor. A tape recorder. Listen to me very carefully. This is why we look at stuff. Collect Claire, pick up the cat, and head home. Okay, so the only way out, I presume, this is Seeks and Communications. I need to use the elevator. An access tuner. And that's the security it's access tuner! Elevator security. Circuits are fried. Fuck! It's, it's broken! We need to fix it! Just need to find a new... Just need to find a new... Oh, I'm sure that's gonna be so easy. Oh, fuck. Uh, no! Bollocks! 
motherfuckers are gonna try to kill me. Where are they? Oh, they're coming from the door up there. I might be able to use my superior stealth tactics to distract them. Emphasis on the might. See anything yet? Oh. Can you see anything yet? I presume they're gonna keep some guys upstairs, some guys downstairs, just to spread things evenly out. Oh no, they're all down there. Oh, the fools! They've been duped. They've been well and truly fucking duped. So I presume I'm going to tech support, right? I'm going to tech support to find a replacement part for this thing. You fucker. You little fucker. You can't see shit. Is he wearing a fucking pullover? He's not coming this way! Don't tell me he comes this way and spots me like that. I'm going for it. I'm fucking going for it, my guys. I am on the move. Bertigue the stealth ninja, the undetectable... I think she went downstairs. Come on. What? I I'm not going down there. No way. Why not? Why ever He's not? Got your hack tool. Oh, shit. It didn't work. We'll find another way up. We've been here too long already. That, that is not a good sound. Oh shit, oh shit. I'm getting in those vents straight away, thank you. Is this a space vending machine? You can dispense fried chicken from a vending machine and it says horse burger. Um, veggie wrap? You can have some chicken nuggets. Oh, it's fresh dispensed chicken nuggets. That I would fucking kill for that sort of thing. Ham, baguette, and pizza. Oh, this is just, this is the best vending machine in the world. I want it in my house. You know, eventually when I get a house. Update map. I'm gonna activate every single one of those I come across. Well, if it isn't the triumphant return of Mr. Pegs. And the appearance of a gun. Most exceptional. Ooh. I do love high caliber revolvers. That is exceptional work. Oh. It sounds like something is directly above this vent. If I ran around in here, I would probably die. Runny, runny, run. Runny, runny, run. Something come and kill me. I am in danger. Or is it just you? I bet it's you, Mr. Peckles! You're making all this fucking noise! Oh, keycard. Yeah, let's let's use that shit. New area, things on the side, IT, ID tag. I'm feeling rather unfazed by the whole horror experience so far. It's, it's, it's taking a while for me to ever end up in any sort of threat of danger. Fuck me. Well, I guess that really puts things into perspective. This man was shot like 82 times in the face. Why do I hear things rattling? Is that computer? Oh. Flashbang. Blasting cap and a sensor. By bonding agent they, mit they literally just mean either tape or a super glue probably. Mm-hmm. The flight recorder. Well I didn't expect to just bump into that. We were looking for communications. Where the fuck is communications? <laughs> What do you mean, what? They wiped it? No. The files are corrupted? What the fuck, guys? What did you do? Did they upload a virus to it or something? Okay. Ah, fuck it. Okay. Well, this is just a fucking okay. piss take. What do you mean, security lockdown? They fucking locked me in here. What is this? Oh! Huh. A new data cell. Well, that was that was generous of them. So can I hack my way out of here? Dun, 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 dun. Okay, so we have to revolve this until signal and then match the symbols. Kinda reminds me of many things, kind of a blend of the Enigma machine from Wolfenstein 2 and the cryptographic access sequencer. I hope I can- I can use the tuna here! You can tune a fish, but you can't tune a sandwich. Um, no. Okay, this was someone's office. Oh my god, what the fuck is this? Uh, some say God created man in his own image, but here at Siegson, we know where our boundaries lie. You really just exposing yourself as the most honest company. Our working Joe synthetics are instantly recognizable and distinguishable from the real thing and are programmed to act that way. I hope I don't have to encounter those freaky looking fucks. We have a tape. Hello? There's nothing on this white oh my god. So they didn't break it. Oh, and I have a smoke bomb too. It's making... 
Um, was this... Oh, they've shut down the stairs. Ah, uh, so I need to go and hack the security panels. Security access toon skis. Right, defeam toon, sing defeam toon. Do -do -do. I'm getting rather good at these. An outpost of progress. The space station that nobody needed, run by a company we forgot. The orders for Siegson's cheaply manufactured androids have long since dried up and the antiquated Apollo governing AI system frequently malfunctions. My name is Julia Jones. We had some things of hers, didn't we? Oh, this is the security lockdown. There we go. What's going on with that vent? That seems a little bit more than a minor ventilation malfunction. Get the fuck away from me. If it isn't the Axel murderer, I actually like that guy. As much of an aggressive survivalist asshole as he was, he was funny. Um... That's, that's a whole lot of hell no. Is that a spine or is that a tentacle? Bit of both, I think. Look at all the chewing gum stuck under the desk. That's disgusting. I mean, I'm about to be equally as much of a fucking horrendous slap. But, um... So, um... How do I win? And, um... I don't know what I'm supposed to be... It probably went through the ceiling, didn't it? Shit. Let's just get the fuck out of here. Let me through, let me through, let me through, let me through, let me through. After all, the creature is still hiding around here somewhere, but this would be a reasonably stealthy shortcut. I'm also quite unnerved out by these cameras. Gah. If only I could see it. After the previous episode, we've seen how sensitive the stealth technology is in this game. We could be just absolutely fucked over at every opportunity. Oh my god. After all, how do you hide from a thing that hunts humans? It's it's killed every single one of them. Oh my god. Oh my god, they're all dead. It can't see me, right? I hope it can't see me. I super... Oh, it's down there. Holy shit. Hopefully it can't smell me or anything. It went in the fucking vents! Um, so I can use this thing as a distraction, right? Rewire. Let's rewire it. Unstable system. We can re-divert power to things that are going to help out. That's... That's not where I am, right? Air purification. No, that, that's on top of me. What? What?! <laughs> How the fuck did you find me? I said the fucking speaker system. The distraction didn't work if I see or hear the alien. Okay, I'm trying option B, which is like try and sneak around this upstairs railing on the right hand side to cause a distraction. I thought one of these things might be in the area. Right. Dingle dongle. Oh, please. Please work. Uh, speaker system. So have I drawn it out of hiding? Or have I just made things worse for myself? I can't see the fucking thing. Oh, there. There, it's right fucking there. Right, I think I'm safe. Beep, ba, boop. Press the buttons. You bastard. Please. Please let me live. Let me live! Yes! Oh, how to seek some communications. Holy shit! Oh good god, they're all running. It's it's probably a good idea to do that. Local departure bay. Naturally all the fucking doors are locked. Oh. Hello. My name's Ripley. Amanda Ripley. I need your help. You look fucking freaky. Someone will be with you. You look familiar, actually. No wonder Seekson is losing the tech race. It does literally look like someone pulled a condom over a mannequin and called it a day. So these things are called Working Joes. These are this station's version of synthetics. It's like Samuels, but, um, far less competent. My name is Miss Man. Can I, help you? I, need I need to, to access comms. comms. It's urgent. That is a restricted area. It's an emergency. Don't you realize what's going on? Apollo has the situation in hand. Oh, you mean the AI that malfunctions all the fucking time because it's cheap as shit? I'll find my own way in. 
What are you doing? What was that little jiggle? I wouldn't advise it. Don't you fucking start sneaking words out behind my back, Mr. Motion Tracker. Some kind of tracker. Ooh! It's been modified. It's getting a little flashbacks. The old Motion Tracker is a uh, horrendous uh, defense, not defense, but like horror tool. Uh, it blurs out the background in favor of the foreground. Um, this is scary because it detects things that are... Oh There's my no god. Problem. No. No problem. Detects things you might not necessarily be able to see. So we can see him leaving our immediate proximity. Here it seems that every new technology research project and discovery is driven to find real world applications to help you. Oh, how sweet. They really are romantics, aren't they, the fucking money grabbing bastards? Marie, if you get this, I'm making my way to Seeks and Communications now. So he's trying to expose the company for what they really are. Um, which is probably going to go well with the others, about as well as a lead fucking balloon. Motion detractor is detecting motion on the other side of this door. You are entering a area. Oh, hello. Uh, what if I refuse? Let me in. I need to contact my I ship. I do need to contact my ship. Okay. It's been how many hours now? What if I don't want There's to be, be registered with Apollo? You guys are all assholes anyway. What if I really try and access the door? Donk. Let me in! You guys don't seem to care, do you? Security access tuner. We are finding an alternate route in. Okay, this is new. It's a QTE lock. Access granted. That's because I am the ultimate hacker of the world. I mean... These androids don't seem so bad, do they? Nice me. Listen to me. We've got to re-establish long-range communications. You're becoming hysterical. I mean, get back. I'm he's being fairly reasonable. Let's resolve this. Oh my God, he's being assaulted. Hughes, I'm pretty sure he's one of the marshals. You're assaulting a marshal? That's clearly against protocol. Oh my god. Good day. <laughs> Good day indeed, you fucking dismissed his soul to fucking heaven. We're gonna have to avoid these cranky AI as best we can. I don't know how easy that's going to be or not. That's a camera right there. Um, that was a lot of stomping, hopefully not. Access terminal. Uh, let's see, your logged message. Sensor sen sensitive corporate information has been automatically detected in a Sevastolink message recently sent by this terminal. He's threatening to go to waits about it. Ah uh, yes, of course, Sevastopol do things differently. In other words, they hide things from everyone. Apollo has cameras everywhere. It just needs someone to tell it where to point to. His name is Daniel Holden, lives in Josiah's executive apartment 651. They just fucking doxed the dude. Mmm, camera feed. Let's disable the camera feed. We don't want to activate the alarm system, though. Is there any reason to go this way, other than to get caught? There's an android patrolling that way. If I go through this door, I am guaranteed almost to be beaten to death. Why am I so... I can hide under desks? That's awesome! Oh, there is a box. Bonding agent. See if I can get out while he's still distracted. You cannot see me! I am the legend of stealth. Right, I'm gonna have to take a dinner break. Sorry, guys. Um, I'm gonna be back. Boom Audacity is going, and now Boom OBS is going, and now if we go over to Capture, we hit Go, and that's recording as well. That's recording as well. Hello chaps, I'm back again to finish what I started and really discover what the seat of all this mystery is surrounding these, um these metal men. The fact that this sector has a section called Human Employee Recreation. 
that almost makes it sound like the machines take priority. So as a quick reminder, these synthetics are stronger, tougher, and faster than human beings, and given that they're operating all on the same AI network, I'd imagine they could strategically network to alert each other of my position if and when I ever do actually expose myself. I don't quite know their patrol route, so um, I'm going to have to experiment. There we go. Camera feed is disabled. Let's use the scanner. Call elevator. Oh, this is an elevator. Right, I see. Something's not going to come out of this, is there? I mean, there's nothing in there, but it, it doesn't hurt to take precautions. Now we have the motion tracker, we can actually, uh, deal with that. Sevastopol, Sevastopol, I'm gonna stab you with a metal pole. And these things look Central like melted Barbie dolls. Oh shit. Seeks and employees only. Oh shit, that's her! Oh, come on, we've got to make it to the terminal then. We've got to make it there. Right, but we've got to be careful. We can't just jump at the opportunity. So I presume I'm safe to just go in here and do a thing, right? I have a vent to escape through. In the event of total destructive annihilation. External communications disabled by order of Apollo. Facility offline. You're kidding me! Communications halted. Great. Dumbass holds L2 to focus. Oh, I see. Oh, that's clever. So you can switch between foreground and background. Do they patrol as far back as back here? That's, that's what I need to know. Oh my god, there's so many of them here. Ah! <laughs> Opening vent. I am the sussiest imposter. Luckily, that goes underneath the whole walkway. That's, that's very nice. How far is he going to go? Just to a new terminal, or is he gonna swap sides? What the fuck? I'm going this way. I don't know what is this way. Monitoring hall? Okay, there is a guy in here. Is that Samuels? Season. What the fuck? They're just sealing up all the data. Reactivate Samuel's communication shit. Well, it's gonna make it easier for me to- What the fuck happened to him? I hope you stay dead. What the fuck? No! I knew he was still alive. Shit. This is intense. Oh, shit. Do I even want to be going in here? Maybe I could just go straight into personnel storage. Maybe this is what the game wants me to do. Oh, shit! Under existing corporate agreements, we should remind you that you must not attempt to read its contents, nor disclose its presence to any third party. Which they did anyway. Oh! What's this? Emergency override. What have I done? How many puzzle networks? What is this? Oh, right, get them to fucking 52 and 87. There we go. Emergency override complete, and... Samuels! You're alive! It's really He is alive! Memory. Holy we shit. We, were we. Worried. we I made it! Where are you? Uh, we're at a transit station now. It's right by medical. Okay. Samuels, listen to me. It's not yeah, safe here. Yeah, it really Seasons is not got safe. This place locked tight. Their goddamn androids are killing people! That's impossible. It's contrary to primary synthetic programming. I've seen it, Samuels. I guess Seekson's got a different idea about synthetics. That is quite and true. there's something else here. A creature. It's big and it's lethal. Ripley, slow down. A creature. It's a life form. A, an unknown type. Some kind of alien organism. It's extremely Well, we know it quite dangerous. well, but, um... You and Taylor Ripley, need to make... Taylor is hurt. She was injured by debris during the crossing. Oh, dear. Is that why you're in oh, medical? Man. I can't move her. I need medical supplies. We need to treat and pack the And injury. the Torrens? The radio is broken. I can't contact Verlaine. We're on our own. Shit. So naturally, we've got to do everything. Okay. I'll come to you. Keep your eyes open. I'll send a transit car to you. <laughs> now all we need to do is not get our head smashed in. Fuck you. So it looks like we can use the vents to travel around. I've got an idea. It's a bit dumb, but I think it's worth a try. So I didn't make this noise, this noise maker for nothing. Right, well, they're distracted by the noise. Ooh, you've been duped! Fucking simply brilliant, my ass! This is where I come out, and there's like 52,000 androids straight out the front of the elevator. So I can get in here now, you motherfuckers. Ironically, the emergency lockdown has unlocked all of the doors. Can I use this terminal? I can. Does it do anything, is what I need to know. Folder corrupted, good. Call log. 
What's going on up there? I've been waiting for a call and... Apollo, please stand by. Your call is being rerouted. Hello, my working Joe is acting strangely. <laughs> ah, help, I'm trapped in my apartment. They all just keep rerouting calls. And to where? Apollo doesn't give no shits. Boingus. Hughes, it's Ransom. I just got your query. Yes, I have been in our transmission relay archive and I've done some decrypting. I'm looking for crew logs that passed through Sevastopol a while ago. I know you're concerned, but it's ancient history. There's just some stuff I need to know. A routine company transmission packet sent from the edge of Thetis before a ship started a trip home. Nothing that's gonna break anything. <laughs> Report from the return leg of our voyage. We'll be ready for our load when we get the call. Dallas, Nostromo captain signing off. Fuckwits on all sides. Right, can I sneak behind him? And exfiltration time! Ooh, god, that was close. Right, so all the androids in this wing are gonna be super pissed off at us whenever we come back here. Take transit to the s To the s To the tower. Right, um, I need transport to that tower, but last time I was here, there was a fucking alien hunting in the area. Oh god, more androids. Oh, that's nice and convenient. They have the science, oh, SciMed, not Skimmed. It's SciMed, science, medical science, medical science tower. How did I not figure that? Because it's functionally terrible. That's the thing. Everything is locked up perfectly well, but as soon as it comes to designing a competent android, they fucking fat-fingered the whole lot and made a death machine. It's the two of you! Taylor's over here. I really did not expect you to still be alive. I'll be honest. Ripley? Is that Ripley? What do you think? Yeah, it's me, bitch. You're not gonna go all crazy on me, are you? Unrest, How is she? Synthetic. She needs treatment. Medical's nearby, but I didn't want to leave her. That's a good I'm idea. Investigate. See what I can find. You stay with her. I'll try to repair the radio booster. What if this creature? You got plenty of lockers. Hide in one of them. Hide. Yeah. Unauthorized security breach detected. All transit shut down. Oh, you asshole! <laughs> Motherfucker! I'm maxed out on a lot of items here. No, those those are more synths. Who? Who's I me? I need a doctor. Hello? I, I need it. I can't hear you. Hang on. Come on, I've opened the elevator for you. There's no time to lose. All right then. Fine. Fuck you. Get into the San Cristobal medical facility. Just to be safe, you're trapping me in this giant <laughs> vent of doom. <coughs> oh, I'm out. A key card. Fuck. Everything's fucking locked. Ever since I got that cryptographic, that fucking security access tuner, it feels like I've been able to go just as. Right. There he is. That's Doctor Schmockta. Is he gonna let me see him in person, or is he just gonna gas me and then? I'm Coleman. Ripley, I need to find a doctor. I'm a doctor. My friend needs help. Hello. Medical supplies. Yes. Me too. There oh. are no supplies on this level. But there are plenty downstairs in the hospital dispensary. How do we get there? We? Do I look like I'm in any fit state? You look I like you're well, alive. And you need mine. You find the passcode for the service elevator and then I'll come down to the hospital with you, okay? Passcode? Yeah. I can direct you from here. Morley or Lingard would have had the new passcode. Morley's office is your So he is one of the doctors from the station. He's somehow still alive. Now, obviously, there's going to be some kind of dangers. Let's work together, huh? Mutual benefit. Keep moving. The area you're in was for our more unstable patients. Those who had trouble adapting to deep space. Just tell me where to go. Tragic cases. Don't worry, they're all long gone. Oh, they are all dead. Thank fuck for that. We're going to take kindly to be left out of the loop. Oh no, so of course, yep, that's what I'm saying. He's a psychopath or something. Oh my god! Senior consultant. I was supposed to be going to the senior consultant. 
Oh, finally! Now I can use the fucking security access tuner. I'm guessing the other panels are locked because it's not a high enough level. Or something. Because I only have V1. Or whatever. There we go. You're there. That's Morley's office. The passcode should be in there somewhere. Morley's office is a fucking mess. Mood stimulants up here. We're getting really low and it doesn't help that Coolman seems to be handling them. Handing them out like candy. It's been to the dispensary system 16 times this week. It's not to... Oh my god, so it, it is as I suspected. It's him being a have bastard. You found the passcode? I do have the passcode. Look, we'll need the physical keycard too. Morley always kept it on him. Find him. Find Morley? What if he's still alive? Warning. Medical facility quarantine breach detected. Warning. Relax. Medical facility I'm just quarantine trying to find breach out what detected. That is. You focus on finding that keycard. Shit. Quarantine breach. So if there's a quarantine breach, where... Where is that exactly? Got to restore power to access that door. Motherfucker. No! Definitely not! Thank you! The alien is active now. It's gone into the ceiling vents, which means I am in... imminent danger. Okay, I can track the alien now. Which is great. There was a locker in here somewhere. Other side, goddammit. We're over there, aren't you? Just stomping around. Nah. 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 Absolutely not. Nah. Get to fuck! Um, shit. What was the fucking passcode? 1702. Let me in! What are these fucking doors? Let me in! Absolutely not! Fucking. Bullshitter! Bullshitter! Absolute bullshitter! It's a fucking bitch! You son of a bitch! Fucker! Can't escape! Sniffing and fucking bitching everywhere! We've just gotta stay calm and be careful not to trip. Stay calm and be careful not to trigger it, right? You fucker! How in the fuck?! That's a fucking dead end. Nice vents, ass face. What?! <laughs> Absolute fucking asshole! Oh no! Fuck you, you green slimy piece of shit! 1702. You can tell it's been through here because it's kicked everything up. Fuck off! And no way has it come all the way here. How do you know? Investigate rooms on Dr. Morley's rounds. It went in the vents? It's a bit of fucking... Oh, you little twat. Don't tell me it found me. Ooh -hoo -hoo. Go fuck off. Go fuck yourself, you green little shit. Pipe bomb. Room A27. It's still not A28, jackass. I'm convinced he's back on the corridors now, see? It's patrolling the corridors again. Fuck off! <laughs> oh 
able to to hold breath, suck my dick. Right, that's it. That's all I've got the patience for today. I'm gonna have to come back and try this section again because I have lost so much progress. Fuck. Ugh. Oh, good lord. Well, thanks for coming, guys. It was really a pleasant experience about as far as me being hungry as holy hell. I'm gonna go get some lunch. But yeah, thank you for watching me have a panic attack again. And uh, I'll see you in the next one. Thanks, guys, and cheerio, chaps. Uh, my name has been Burgoo5, and I will see you in the next flipisode, motherfuckers.